McCormick Darien logo on the front of the the box. A one shot lettering enamel. This color happens to be the chamois. One shot lettering enamel. A quality quill brush. Uh, I have laid out the I wanted this to be have sharp corners. Mask it off and do it. Okay. Uh, the layout up to date is I added the border, uh, put the bosses in for I'll paint two, four screw heads in the border, and then lay out the lettering, put a scroll, a banner. Uh, the color on this project, the base color uh, is dark hunter green. Uh, matter of fact, it's rust -oleum. I put uh, three coats of dark hunter green on the bare plywood because I wanted the texture, uh, the wood texture, and then uh, chamois is the one-shot color. Uh, I have laid it out with a tape to get it completely uh, square and uh, uniform, and to hold true to the factory logo. Today I'm just going to use a. Uh, it's as a matter of fact, it's a red sable brush. Um, I, I like it. I laid this out a little bit heavy with a stiblo uh, lettering pencil. Uh, it's actually a grease pencil. Uh, you can write on glass with it. They come in all different colors. I laid this out a little bit heavy uh, for the camera. Uh, and I did lay out some straight lines. I want these to be straight. Um, but as such, uh, The secret is practice, practice, practice. You can impart movement to an object by the little fine lines, and uh, this is a banner, so it would have a fold in it, uh, so you can put the lines in there to insinuate movement. Decided to uh, letter the script with uh, white uh, one-shot lettering enamel. The impact of the color, um, it's going to be viewed from afar. I decided to go with uh, white. And I'm still wanting to stay with the old-time look. Uh, border known but not I'm not going to antique it uh, on this on these lettering and for the uniformity of it, uh, there's absolutely nothing wrong with it. Uh, as a matter of fact, it's uh, you should be doing it, doing it if you are not. Just carry on in a like manner. This is going to be seen at some distance. Standard practice. Uh, lay your work out. You have to have some guidelines. Get out 
get the job done. Uh, this has been quite an enjoyable project. I have I have got some favorable comments uh, from people from one, th those who have saw the tester. Uh, some favorable uh, comments on uh, YouTube. This was a advertising logo for International after they had merged with McCormick Deere. This logo would have been down at the feed store. It would have been a metal sign. It was on their letterheads that mailing envelopes. It was a a logo seen by a lot of people. A logo can make or break a company. Uh, no doubt about that. IHC logo. I hope you have enjoyed uh, watching the video. Uh, check back here on YouTube. I'll uh, I will post something else. Uh, I do have a couple more projects. Uh, he had killed that hippie dude out there in the shop using some country boy logic. Ah, uh, thanks now. Shop dog Sam here.